it's Meridani and we are going to review the James Charles Morphe palette today and I'm going to do it quick as fuck because I'm in a hurry. So let's get this bad boy out. Cute. I always keep the the, the name thing. Is that weird? Is it to do an after that? Magique, Magnifi. I've never had this many colours at my disposal. Like, there's so many. I just, like, I might go insane. Okay, I'm going to smash this, like, so quick. I'm probably going to fuck it up because I'm trying to go too fast. But I don't care. All right, smashing this. I did Mario Badescu Facial Spray. Set for moisturizing crumb to jack my face off. Maybe I should time this. What do you reckon? If I can do it in under like 15 minutes, then I should get a reward. I mean, I don't know what kind of reward. Like, I'm giving the reward to myself. So, is it even really worth it? I don't know. Anyways, Laura Mercier Blurring Primer, my best friend. Lano Lips Multi Lip Balm, the orange one. I'm like flashing these way too quick. Cool. All right, Too Faced um, Shadow Insurance 24 Hour Anti Crease Eye Primer. Eyeshadow Primer? Yeah, that is what it's called. This shit is good as fuck. Should probs be using a brush or something, but fuck that. I'm in a hurry. <laughs> Amazing. Done. Concealer brush. I probably really don't need to do this since I put that eyeshadow primer thing on. But also, I'm going to do it anyways. Right. Cool. Um, I'm going to put my eyebrows on first because I didn't do that last time and I looked a lot crazy. And then I had to go back and like do it afterwards and I don't know, I kind of fucked it. So, I mean, not that it's going to be any better today, but either way. Okay. So, first off, I did the hourglass. <clears throat> <coughs> I don't have Rona. I do use the Hourglass um, eyebrow pencil. Um, now I'm just using spoolie brush and I'm going to use the Morphe brow pomade powder shit. I don't know. Oh, fuck. See, this is why I did it first. Fucking fuck. You know how they say eyebrows are like sisters, not twins? Mine are often not even fucking friends. So there's a bit of truth for you. Alright, I'm going to fix that line now.
Okay, so I better not fuck up this eyeshadow because already I can feel that that um, eyeshadow primer is really on there. Like it's really working. I can, like it's tight. Like it's sticky. Is that the words? I don't know. Anyways, <clears throat> I don't really know what I'm going to do here. I'm just going to wing it. Which is essentially what happens every time I do this. I don't know. I'm, I'm feeling like a rainbowy kind of thing like yesterday. Um, <clears throat> and if you haven't seen that video, that's a review of the Icy Fantasy 351 palette. And there'll be a link somewhere for you to look at that if you are interested. Um, I'm going to be dangerous and go ahead and go straight into this blue colour. It's bright as fuck. And I hope I don't fuck this up. Maybe I should just do the thing that he does on the front. But like obviously not as good. <laughs> and in less time. And shittier. Mm, that colour is brighter than I thought it was going to be. So that's fine. We can work with that. I always feel like starting in the bottom corner of each eye is like a safe spot. A safe place. Um, now I'm going to use this, like, other pink one. Cool. And I'm going to do it, like, in the crease. Alright, okay, I don't hate this. Not horrific. I also go quite high to the eyebrow on eyebrow bone, whatever, this bit. <laughs> um, on the ends, just because I have such hooded eyes. So if I go, it's fucking all gone. I feel like the whole night I have to look like this. Hold my eyebrows up real high. Okay. Now that we have a base, I'm going to um, ruin my clean brushes and I'm going to do this like dark purpley kind of colour. Yep, ruined the brush, amazing. And I'm just going to blend that into this outside bit here. Right in that creasy bit. So it's dark but not black. And then just down to the eye. Yep. That's gonna happen. I wanna keep that top bit nice and pink. Pinky, purpley, whatever the fuck colour that is. And just like into my crease. Blend into the crease. I had a makeup artist tell me one time um, to open my eye while I put it in the crease because otherwise I can't really get in there properly. Like it doesn't. I don't know. That's just what she said. So now that's what I do every time. Not hating. And now that I've made that blue like non-existent, I'm just gonna like put it on again. And blend it into the purple. Alright. Okay, alright, okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna use a darker blue. Um, just in here. Because I can. I'll do. Let's look at what he did. Obviously already better than mine, but anyways, whatever. Also, I feel like my eyebrows come down too low to, like, do what he did. Either way, I'm going to try some other shit. <clears throat> um, I'm gonna use this super bright ass orange, yellow orange, up here. Bit in the inner corner. Probably all the way up. I 
All right, we're looking a little bit hot, messy. <clears throat> a little bit. So I'm going to just more pink in here to blend into that orange colour. It's kind of better. All right, cool. Um, now what I'm going to use is I'm going to take one of these, like, packing brushes. I think that's what it's called. Um, and I'm going to use the white colour. Um, and we're going to see how white it is. And also because I remember how I said that I always just use my concealer. Oh, wow. That's actually, like, coming out pretty white. Whoa, I'm impressed with this white, man. I am impressed. And then I'm just going to use the blue one to blend together. I mean, it's out there, but, like, I don't hate it. Um... All right, next I'm going to use this um, dark blue glittery colour. I don't know if you can see that it's glittery, but it is. And I'm going to put that in here because I want to be shiny. Cool. Um, now I'm going to take a blending brush that doesn't have anything on it um, just to kind of Blend all this shiz together. It's kind of better. Hating. I'm not hating. I'm not hating. Okay, um, now I'm going to put some actual face on and then I'll do the underneath. Yeah, yeah, that's that's the game plan. Cool. So again, I'm going to be using the Born This Way um, Too Faced foundation because I love this shit. Makeup brush that I should probably get a new one of. I look fucked. Right now, I look fucked. Concealer to cover up my bags. Fab, cool. So I'm gonna um, put some shit on to bake my face now. Um. That's something everyone should do. I'm going to use this brush that I bought, um, I think it was on Wish like a hundred years ago. I don't know if I'm doing this right. Bake the five head. Okay, so let's get back to the eyes. <clears throat> so I think I'm going to use that white again, white colour. Just go in here again after blending it. What I would normally do is put concealer along there and then the colour, which I mean, I guess I probably could have still done that, but I just wanted to see how well the white would do. And look, I reckon it's done pretty fucking well. Um... I'm going to take an angled brush in the black and hope that I don't fuck this whole thing up. I want that to be my, like, corner. Yeah. I almost feel like that's made that look really dark where the purple was. But maybe it's just this light. That brush that had nothing on it, just as a blending tool, because otherwise this black line is going to look a little fucking janky. 
And I might just put some more of that pink on just like so it's still there. Yeah, cool. I like that. I like big boys, itty bitty boys, Mississippi boys, and the city boys. Ooh. Um, a little cheat that I, oh, I just put the handle off my drawer. Anyway, a little cheat that I like to use, I don't know, it's, I don't know, it's not really a secret, is I'll just put some uh, micellar water. The one I like is the Mecca Max one on a cotton bud. And I'll just, just to gently clean that line up. And then I'll get my concealer brush. And fuck it up. Good good job, Carl. Just fix my mistake there. That'll do. Be careful with the other side. Or just fuck it up again. Alright, I'm into this. I'm into this. Okay, now I'm going to take a big ass brush and wipe this shit off my face. See what I mean about hooded eyes? Now let's give our face some dimensions. I'm using um, this bronzer everywhere. Just put that shit everywhere. Now I've successfully given myself a better face, angled brush, blush. Hi boo. Hello. Oh puppy. I'm going to highlight. Okay, now I'm just going to chuck some highlighter, some highlighter on um, my brow bones. I'm going to use this, um, which I talked about in another video. It's the best shit ever. I don't have a name of the brand because it was just some girl who was starting a festival line. If you stalk my Instagram hard enough, you'll find the post. Oh, just, mm, girlfriend. She did so good with that. I'm gonna go underneath with that gold, that not that gold, what am I talking about? That um glittery blue that I put on the outside and and mixing it with the other blue, the blue I used the first time. Oh, yeah, I'm into that. All right, now I'm gonna do green. Green is actually my favorite color. My boyfriend always picks on me for not using green um, when I like do my nails, do my hair, whatever. Not my hair, but you know what I mean. Like I do my makeup or my nails and um, he always picks on me. So I'm using the light green and the dark green mixed together. Again, I don't know if this is gonna go good, but whatever. So that's the mixed two. And then, just because I want it really bright, I'm going to use just the lighter green by itself, just right here and into the corner. That's, yeah, that's, that's the money shot. I'm so freaking proud right now. Fuck yeah. I'm going to just put more pink up here because I put that highlighter up there. And then I kind of fucking ruined it. But anyways. Oh. Oh. Mm. Mm. I feel like such a gangster right now. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm feeling myself so hard. Okay, um, now I'm just going to get another fluffy brush. I'm going to put it in this like champagne glittery nothing colour and just like 
dab on just because I want to. Okay, cool. And now I'm going to go again with this trusty, but it's hard to get off, highlighty thing right in here. I'm so freaking proud of this right now. Okay, I'm going to do a baby bit of eyeliner. Um, I'm using the Stilla um, eyeliner. Yes, it's a tester because I'm poor. And again, I'm going to use the MAC In Extreme Dimensions 3D Black Lash. Mascara, again, a tester. <clears throat> That's my favourite thing. It's the reason I bought all this shit from Mecca is because they have a beauty loop box. And you get free shit. P.S. I would just like to attest to all those people, creators, wannabe creators... People starting out, YouTube, whatever, I don't care. Um, I just found out that you can get Final Cut Pro in the Education Bundle on the Apple website in Australia, $2.99, um, instead of paying for it in the App Store for $499. And you get like four or five other um, apps that you need, or don't need, but like could use for a similar thing. And I just, I'm like... Why didn't I do that earlier? I was using iMovie for the longest time. Um, and it's not, like, it's okay. It's not bad. It's just not nearly as good as Final Cut Pro is. And, like, I know that because I've used Final Cut Pro before, previously on an old laptop that I maybe might have sneakily downloaded. Anyways, now I'm trying to be legit and pay for things, so. This is it. This is the look. I'm just going to put some more Lano lips, um, this strawberry one, because it was right in front of me. Because I don't think I need a lipstick. I think this is too, like, it's there's a lot going on up here, so I don't want to detract from it by putting on a bright colour. So I'm just going to leave it shiny. And I used to, when I was younger, I was like, I'll always wear lipstick. I would never just wear a gloss, but I'm stupid. And um, now I'm older and not as stupid, but still kind of stupid. Anyway, I'm done with my face. I'm happy. I'm going to um, spray it with the Glam Glow Glow Setter. The best shit ever. It smells good. It feels nice. It's like misty, not like a wet on your face, um, which is what you want in a, well, it's what I want in a makeup spray. I don't know. Anyway. If you had a good time or a laugh or you enjoyed figuring out how we do this, um, then like, unsubscribe, comment, leave me some love. Um, I would love that. That would make my day if you could do that. That'd be great. Cool. If you want more of this, then tell me. Otherwise, I will stop doing it. Okay, so I forgot that I actually didn't talk about the thing that I was reviewing. <laughs> um, so I think the um, colour pigments are really good. So you don't need a lot to get the look, I guess. These are the face brushes I use. So I used a lot. I don't like to use the same one for, the same, for different colours. Um, but you can see the colour... Like, that's just after one dip and a little shake. So, um, very good. I think there's a wide range of colours, which is really good. Um, especially if you're only just kind of starting out. You don't have that many colours. It's got the nudes and it's got bright colours as well. So you can experiment and learn. Um, so, all in all, I think it's a pretty good purchase. Yeah. Thanks. This puppy. This is boyfriend. What do you think of my eyes, boo? Beautiful. Beautiful? Beautiful. I did good? Yeah. Thanks. Okay, I just wanted to say, so I just cleaned my brushes and um, this is what they look like. So they're kind of stained. I've cleaned them, I cleaned them with this artist artist brush cleaner um, after I use them just straight away to get, get as much product off as I can because I can't be fucked later on. Um, 
but they're kind of stained. So that's a thing that's happened with this palette, but there you go. Anyway, 